Um, let's take a look at the story in the front of the FT for tomorrow morning, the North-South Divide. What's this about? So this is about... Um the, um, well, the stories about uh, the fact that a lot of the um, northern powerhouse um, projects, which were, you know, which started under uh, George Osborne's chancellorship, really was his sort of big project, mm -hmm. um, which are now finding themselves to be cash strapped as the government sort of moving away um, from it. Um, and there's a bit of comparison there about um, how much money is spent, for example, in London and the South when it comes to sort of um, uh, uh, tra uh, transport. Uh, infrastructure mm. and the north kind of loses out and if we are to make this country a sort of a if we are to create mm. this culture of making or helping business move mm. out of london so that the entire country can benefit from those mm. yeah. uh, um, those investments um then there's obviously a case uh, for more to be done there um my point is also i think this is an important point i don't really know where mm. you stand on ages two really kevin but but i mean that is something that that it just seems like a complete waste of money to a lot of us um a, it, the, the case the business case for that is hugely disputed a huge amount of money is being pumped into that um, and i've always felt that in, in instead of making grand gestures like that which really is to a great extent legacy building for politicians it would be much money would be much better spent it would be greater value for taxpayers if a lot of the existing lines were developed um, and, and connection between you know different places in the country was, was sort of you know developed that way so so better investment of the money that we already have um, rather than you know these grand political gestures yeah hs2 is really about it's, it's not just shorter journey times it's about uh, increasing capacity particularly freight has been squeezed off the rail off rail because they haven't got the the track time for it uh, I'm, I'm dubious about it. I'm a, I'm a skeptic. I'm mm. not absolutely against it. But the point that IPPR mm. North are making here is over the past decade, there's been £59 billion more transport in, in uh, investment uh, in London and around the South East, in the, in the South, uh, as against the North. And schemes of electrification schemes have been cancelled in the North, been cancelled in uh, South Wales too, and in, in the Midlands. And there is that North South mm. divide. Now, mm. to some extent, you can see why more money is in London and the South East, because it's more congested. Mm. Uh, it's a part of the economy that generates a lot of, a lot of wealth. Mm. You've certainly got to sort, uh, sort it out. But I don't see why the North should be neglected. Mm.